my queens, it's Dana Persia. Welcome back to my channel. This is where you get the real deal on real beauty. Well, today I'm starting something brand new. It's my wedding series, Wedding Wednesday. Every Wednesday, God willing, I will be posting a new video focusing on my brides, my bridal clients. Some of you may or may not know that I own Beautiful Brides Philly. We are an on-location hair and makeup company. We bring the beauty to you on the day of your wedding. So whether you're getting ready at your house or your a hotel room or the venue, we bring the entire team to you. I wanted to bring this series to my brides because I find that many of them come to my studio and they get their makeup trial and they're having trouble with their skin and they wanna know what to do to make their skin look their, its absolute best on their wedding day. I'm an esthetician. Uh, I have been an esthetician for a little over 15, 20 years, and I know skin, and I know makeup. So every Wednesday, we're gonna have a wedding Wednesday. If you see this white backdrop, you know that we're gonna be talking all things bridal, and we may talk about hair, makeup, skin, we may even talk about styling. So make sure you subscribe and ring that bell so you can get notifications on when my next video is. Today's first Wedding Wednesday video is all about skincare because I feel like we have to start at the beginning. No matter how much makeup you put on your face, if your skin is not in good condition, it's not gonna look good. You're gonna have flaking, you're gonna have um, hyperpigmentation, you're gonna have all kinds of things that just isn't good for wedding day perfection. And through my series, I'm hoping that you all who are getting ready for your weddings, I know a lot of you postpone your weddings. I've been dealing with it for the last eight or nine months. Everybody's struggling with trying to figure out when they can have their wedding. So now you have plenty of time to get your skin ready. I am going to bring you my tried and true routines and habits and things you can add today. You want to start today. Whether you're 20, 30, 40, 50 or over, you want to make sure you have a good routine. If you care about your skin and you want to look great with or without makeup, my company really specializes in the natural bride. We can do, you know, contouring and smoky eye, but our clients come to us because we really have mastered the no makeup makeup look. And the reason that is, is it's what our clients want. And also we make sure that they understand that it's about the skin first. This first video is just gonna be me doing my routine, showing you what I do on a regular basis. And it's kind of just it, it, all encompassing. It includes cleansing, exfoliating, moisturizing, eye treatment. What's gonna happen during the next few months when I do these videos is I'm gonna break down every component of skincare. So I might have a video just on cleansing you know, using a Clarisson, you know, facial cleansers, especially if, you know, we're targeting different types of skin. If you have sensitive skin, oily skin, dry skin, mature skin, I'm gonna break this all down. I'm gonna show you everything that you need to know to have the best skin ever. So this video, again, is going to go through whole range of steps from beginning to end and then just to kind of give you an overview of the things you should be doing. The products I use are just my personal products. Some of them are high end, some of them aren't. And please, if you have any comments or suggestions or ideas, things that you want to see me talk about in this wedding series, please put them in the comments. I look at everything and I really do look at what my viewers want to see. Create content based on that. Let's get ready for my first official Wedding Wednesday video. One other thing I did want to say is this is not just for brides. This is for everyone. So if you're someone who isn't getting married, but you want to see a difference in your skin over the next three, four, six, seven months, a year, definitely share this video, talk about it, comment, because although I'm calling it Wedding Wednesday, obviously it's not just for brides. So I hope you enjoy this. Remember again to subscribe and ring that bell so you can get notifications for when I post. I also post on Fridays different types of videos on all things skin and beauty, but Wednesdays are going to be my platform for those of you who are getting married. All right, my queens, take care and have a great day.
anything you want to do is start with a wet face and I'm using soy cleanser by fresh about a nickel to quarter size amount make sure you get your eyes especially if you're wearing eye makeup and this cleanser is great it takes off your eye makeup with no problems you want to use circular motions the idea is to give yourself a mini massage now you want to take it off with a warm wet washcloth nothing too hot nothing too cold and we're going to do that twice and then we're going to use the strawberry sugar exfoliator by fresh i'm loving fresh's products these days and don't forget your neck and your t-zone where you get a lot of congestion also you can use some massage strokes always lifting and then rinse with a warm washcloth again and you're going to definitely do this a second time to get all that grit off and it just feels really good to to use a warm washcloth and then you splash with some lukewarm water to get the rest of the exfoliator off pat dry with a clean towel now you can use a toner. You can either use a hydrating toner or a gly glycolic toners are great. They are wonderful for an added boost of exfoliation, taking care of hyperpigmentation, um, leaving your skin fresh and clean and ready for your serums and your moisturizers. So you can just put them on a little cotton pad. At nighttime, I like to use my glycolic toner. It's 7% glycolic toner and in the mornings uh, for eye treatment I use an eye roller with a stainless steel ball but at night I like to use more of a moisturizing eye cream with lots of vitamins and nutrients that really work overnight to take care of any fine lines and wrinkles so if you're not using an eye cream I highly recommend adding it to your routine The next step would be to put your daily moisturizer on after your eye cream if you're going out uh, to face the day. Definitely something with an SPF. At night I use more potent vitamin C serum and vitamin C moisturizer. I'm using Peter Thomas Roth right now. I'm really loving that brand. So at night uh, I also use Vichy, which you can actually get at CVS. And it's considered a higher end drugstore brand. So right now I am putting on my serum. And one of the things I learned is to pat the serums and moisturizers into the face to really make sure that that first dermal layer absorbs everything that you're putting on your skin. And after my serum, I would put my moisturizer on. You can skip the serum in the morning. You don't have to use a serum if you're using it at night. So this is how you get great skin, ladies and men for that matter.